Hi guys! To see how I got this makeup look and to enter the giveaway, keep watching! So I'm getting ready to go to an event tonight at the Boys and Girls Club. It's a fundraiser and it's dinner and drinks and music and I'm really looking forward to having fun tonight. So I'm getting my face ready by completely washing it, exfoliating. I used my natural oils on my face and I am going to use uh, an eye cream that this company sent to me. It comes in this really cute pouch. And this is the container. And I will read all of the information. I've been using this for about two weeks now, morning and night. And first, I really love the smell. It smells not perfumey, but kind of fruity. You only need such a tiny, tiny bit. So I am going to moisturize my eyes. This really helps the foundation go on so much better. So I'll read you a little bit about this cream. It's called V2 Code, the second oxygen eye cream. And I've actually been using it in combination with the V2 Code eye mask. And these come in packages and they have gel on them and you just stick them right under your eyes. I've been using these for about a month now and I feel like my under eyes are so much more hydrated and the fine lines are less noticeable. My dark circles are just really bad. I was born with them. I honestly don't know if anything will ever get rid of them. I have tried every product under the sun so I really wasn't expecting for them to disappear, but having the skin much more hydrated and the lines looking less noticeable make my under eyes look better altogether. So the cream is V2 Code, the second oxygen eye cream. It activates the skin's natural repair system to shed dryness, wrinkles, help with dark circles, bags, and loose skin and you use it during the day and at night. So during the day, it protects your skin against external damage from UV rays and pollution, and at night it repairs damaged cells. So I have a little surprise today. Since so many people were commenting on the oxygen iPads that I was using, I am giving this away. So I will leave all the information below how to enter to win these Oxygen iPads. For foundation, I am going to mix my Mary Kay TimeWise foundation with my Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum. And this one's a little bit darker. I wanted to darken up my TimeWise color. I actually ordered a new one because uh, it's spring and I'm going to start spray tanning. Well, actually today I spray tanned my legs so they're way darker than this part up here. And I'm wearing long sleeves so you can't really tell that my arms aren't tanned. So I definitely want to make my face a little darker today. This is actually the first time that my legs have seen the light of day all winter and I'm wearing a dress with no pantyhose or tights or anything, so spray tan is always the best way to go for me. So I'm mixing the two colors together. 
and I'm using a damp makeup sponge. And I'm going to use my e.l.f. highlighter. And I have, I am still having major breakout around my mouth from my hormones going crazy. I actually finished off my blood work two days ago. I look like a pin cushion. I'm all bruised everywhere and they even had to go into my hand, which doesn't look bad. So at least that's all done. All my blood work is in, so I have one more test. I've been doing ovulation testing and I had to count six days after that, which will be Monday. And I do my last testing for hormones. And then on Thursday, I go in for a double dip. I am not looking forward to it. My first colonoscopy, endoscopy, and because of my, um, bowel issues. I had a bowel blockage after my um, abdominal repair with mesh and had to go back into the hospital so my colon is not working correctly. So they're giving me a special prep. <laughs> it's not going to be fun. It's going to be 30 hours of no food and on the toilet and no sleep. So I'm just trying to think positive and look at it like this is it. This is this is the end of my testing and then we can go from there and get me better. So because my face is just breaking out like crazy, I am going to add a thick concealer and this is my Sheer Cover Duo Concealer in Light Medium. that with my Fit Me powder and I'm going to use a dry sponge for everything that I'm using on my face today because my skin is dry because of the products I've been using to exfoliate my skin and when I use a sponge to apply everything you don't see any dry patches and when I use a brush and my skin is really dry, you'll see flaking. So everything that I put on my face today, I am using a sponge. And I'm going to use my Garnier Anti-Dark Circle Roller. And I'm going to do kind of a little contouring, but I'm more doing this to darken up my skin a little bit. I'm using my NYX Wonder Stick. And it has the dark color on one side and the lighter color on the other.
and I'm going to use my sponge that I applied my foundation with to blend it in. And I'm going to use some IT Bye Bye Pores. This is in Naturally Pretty. And I'm using a sponge. off of my eyebrows I'm going to use my ultra bow to do my eyebrows And I'm going to fill in my brows a little more with my NYX Micro Brow in Taupe. Now I'm going to use my Garnier Anti-Dark Circle Roller around my eyebrows. For eyes, I am going to use my Wet n Wild palette, The Naked Truth. And I'm going to use the lightest color all over my lid. And I'm going to use this brown color.
then I'm going to use the darkest brown color with my eyeliner brush. That color, this is Pure Bliss Makeup Setting Spray. It's all organic. It doesn't smell pretty like flowers, which I usually like, but I like that it's organic. So this is what I've been using. And when you wet your brush, you can really use anything. It doesn't have to be a setting spray. You can just dip it in water. I'm going to use my Becca highlighter in opal. I'm going to use some of my Revlon liquid eyeliner. It's Color Stay Skinny in Mahogany Flame. I'm going to use Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner in Brown. And I'm going to use a L'Oreal Voluminous Million Lashes in Waterproof Black is Black. I'm going to wipe the foundation off of my lips with a damp washcloth. And I'm going to use my Revlon Color Stay Overtime in Boundless Brandy.
end, I'm going to do a second coat. And ready to go. Don't forget to enter down below for the V2 Code Oxygen Eye Mask Giveaway. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!